saying that we have these laws that are still restricting sex workers and that are still preventing women from reporting crimes when sex work is the oldest profession. It's not going away. Mm. This is, this well, is going to continue happening. And there was a, um, the, a sur- the, basically the one survey on sexual practices in America that has been accepted as being done correctly and actually being statistically um, correct was the um, Sex in America survey. And that survey said that 16% of men in the United States have paid for sex. It's a really huge percentage. Um, So this is a very normal activity. And I find that um, because I'm out as um, having done sex work and I, I talk about it really openly, people come out to me all the time who are not out to anybody else, you know, but they know they can tell me. So because I'm out in the world talking about sex work, talking about mm-hmm. sex worker issues, talking about having worked as a sex worker, everywhere I go, people come out to me as sex workers. And I feel like it's it's very similar to where the gay rights movement was maybe 20 years ago or 30 years ago, where most people are in the closet, but there's a huge number of people out there who are current and former sex workers and nobody knows. And once we start, you know, coming out and if it becomes decriminalized and we start eradicating the discrimination, people are going to be amazed at like the family members who stripped for a year to get through that year of college or the, you know, like whatever. Um, I've always thought if we could have a million man march of, of every man that's ever been to a sex worker, um, I mean, it would be one of the largest demographics of men in America. Yeah. 16%. I, and I don't have numbers of like how many people do this or that other kinds of activities, but how many people play soccer or how many people have been right. on a baseball team? Right. You know, other really normal activities, I, I think. Sure, and it's pretty it normal to go to a strip club, yet there's mm-hmm. still a lot of shame about working at a strip club. Yeah.